Chapter 2. His name is Fjordal. Fowler's daddy is a repairer. He repairs what has to be repaired. From the Caspian Sea to the Nordic Sea. From the Red Sea to the Dead Sea. Sometimes he even repairs at home. This mackerel cannot be repaired anymore, Daddy says, and puts a whole slice of bread with mackerel in tomato sauce in his mouth. Daddy looks very smart while he tells us. <coughs> Daddy looks very smart while he tells little about what he has done recently. He has helped a whale to find his way up to England. He has taken out a hook of the tail of a flounder. Enough, Daddy says. And he claps on his belly. Something is moving inside the bag now. Tell me what's in there, Pala moans. Daddy chews and thinks, but that doesn't look like he was listening. No, I've little work to do now, he just says, and takes the bag with him into the workshop. Pala is disappointed. Daddy is standing up from the table and walks away, without showing what he's brought with him. And so there's nothing left to Pala but to clear the table alone. Can you come in here, little Pala? Daddy is suddenly asking. Now it is Pala who pretends he wasn't listening. But then Daddy is standing at the door. But there you are, he says. Don't you want to come in and see what I've brought here? The workshop is actually the most funny place Pala knows. There's the power saw and the tape, hammer and pincers and little pins that you can hardly see, and a complete shelf with stones from the ground of the East Chinese Sea. Yep, sure, I'm coming, Pala says, and is running into Daddy. Daddy carefully opens the bag so Pala can see. Two eyes are staring at them. This is Fjordal, Daddy says, and lifts up a huge cod. Fjordal is staring with big eyes, first at all the tools and the postcards on the wall, then at Daddy and Pala. Who's that little guy there? Fjordor says, yawning. This is Pallas, says Daddy.